The Kansas City Chiefs are Super Bowl champs for the second straight season. The Chiefs beat the 49ers 25 to 22 in overtime last night, and our 27 sports director Glenn Kenley got down on the field after the game to gather confetti, of course, and to recap what Chiefs fans might remember as a stressful Super Bowl. Good morning from Allegiant Stadium, where the confetti is still on the field from last night's Chiefs victory. It was a comeback overtime walk-off win to give the Chiefs back-to-back -back Super Bowl championships, one that solidifies Patrick Mahomes' legacy with three rings by the age of 28. But it was the defense that stole the show here in Las Vegas last night. Any team that went two Super Bowls in a row, they're doing something special. That it's no fluke. You can't accidentally stumble into this. This is a blessing. We got a great staff, great players. We got great training staff, everything. And I think that's what it takes to have a dynasty. The defense, the young guys grew up, and but nobody ever pointed fingers at the offense when the offense was growing. And it, it, it all kind of came together during the playoffs and uh, worked out well and great leaders. And Patrick and Chris and, and Trav and the job, you know, that they've, they've done. Uh, they're, they're passionate players, man, and I love that. I talked to fans as they were leaving this building last night, asking them, what does this win do for Patrick Mahomes and his legacy? They say no doubt about it. He's the best in the league right now, and he's well on his way to being the best to ever play the game of football. Hard to argue with that. It's three rings in the last five seasons with no signs of slowing down for Mahomes and the Chiefs. Working for you in Las Vegas, Glenn Kinley, 27 Sports.